the last few modifications I'm going to do is take these lines out of this plastic intake block here. I don't know if you can see those real well. Okay, I'm just going to smooth those out a little bit. Probably rough that up with some 80 grit paper. And then this air horn, I'm going to take and clean up all this. Enlarge it just a little bit. Can't do a lot. But I'll do what I can and still keep the strength for that wing nut on here. All right. Okay, now I'll be back. I'll show you this when it's done. All right, the intake block's got that little line taken out of it. Okay, I'm not sure if I'll smooth this up some more. I'm not going to rough that up with the 80 grit. Okay, uh, the intake horn here is all set. The bridge is thinned down. I took quite a bit of material out of it, as you can see down here. I mean, that's a lot of, lot of aluminum there coming out of here, but should just help enhance the airflow. I didn't change any of this uh, diameter here, so we'll get a good sealing surface. I'll probably put just a tiny bit of a motor seal and make a gasket for it. I like to seal that against the carburetor. And uh, maybe I have something like that hanging around. But anyways, that's what we got. All right, for those of you who remember, okay, the factory side, I built the other box for it. I put another outlet over here. Okay, so we're going to get rid of this big heavy screen setup in here that goes in there. Because I put screens in here. All right, now they're not real user friendly. They'll probably never come out. This metal was pretty thick. There's a lot of hacksaw and bending in the vise, and I ended up with what I have. Okay, but it does have the spark arrestors in there, and it should be a big improvement over running this thing. All right, I'm going to paint this up, get it on the saw and fire it up for the first time. Let's see if this thing will even start. I don't know who's been waiting longer, me or you, but I bet it's the guy who owns the saw has been waiting the longest. Wait a minute, I got it on stop. That's my fault. Darn Husqvarna's. There we go. Okay. Mm -hmm. 